I've always had a long-held interest in the natural world. I'm sure all of us as kids remember like playing in the backyard or just being outside and all of us are like, you know, part of the earth and the earth is part of us. And I was trying to find this in-between of landscapes having a personified look. My name is Aurora Isabella and I am a recent graduate with a BFA in sculpture and painting and drawing. How the Wind Moves the Leaves in the Light is a visual exploration and documentation of my personal experiences and perspectives of the natural and industrial worlds today. Concept is really important to me, but also uh, for me, what makes art so mysterious and kind of attractive is just the overall beauty and prettiness that you can kind of get out of these. And I know that a lot of us kind of just gravitate towards things that are nice to look at and we want to be surrounded by that. Whenever I begin a new piece, I try to find a way to push myself like conceptually and technically and uh, I'm sure everyone's heard lately about the use of AI in artwork and I was curious about how I could use that since it is exploring that intersection of humans and nature and what is there and what is something that we've created. I used AI as a tool to help push the piece and it was a very subtle way that it pushed itself. I just took photos of the painting, put it into Dali, and kind of mimicked some of the patterns and lights from their reiterations. The newest piece in the show, What Looks Like Water, it's this standing sculpture piece and it has abstracted organic forms with a burette attached to it that had hydrogen peroxide in it and it would drip onto this unpainted, unfinished, like roughly cut steel. The piece is inspired by industrial agriculture. Everyone deserves access to food and industrialized agriculture has allowed this to happen. Um, so there's kind of this gray area of it kind of damaging the soil quality that we have and the quality of the food, but at the end of the day, it's still food that we can consume. A lot of the pieces are chaotic and kind of messy in the layering, and some of them are pretty direct. And I think that that's just how I view this whole situation. There are moments of clarity, and then there are moments of absolute like dress, and my emotions are all over the place. For people walking through my exhibition, I think the overall tone and mood I want them to walk away with. The first one that comes to mind is enjoyment. I want them to enjoy the pieces and sit with them 